where you can wear on your special occasions, events, formal events, something like that where you want it to look presentable. So if you want to see how I will do it, then keep on watching. For my moisturizer, I'm going to use this Cafe Doll Milky Splash Body Essence. It will also act as my makeup paste. As you can see, there's a milky essence there. Make sure it is fully absorbed on the skin and then that's it. I'm also going to prep my lips so I'm I'm going to use the lips Cathedral Lip Smile Color Lip Balm stick. So skip my sunscreen because the thing that I'm going to use has SPF on it so I'm still protected with the UV rays. I'm going to use the Cathedral AA Autom or the Automatic Aura Cream with the SPF 45 p 8 plus 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 so I still have protection from the sun rays. I'm in the shade Natural Beige so that's what I'm going to use as my cream for today. I will put the AA cream on the parts where I normally put my concealer, like the under eyes. It will act as my concealer. I also like this product because it's really lightweight as in as in you don't feel like you have product on your face. So see it helps brighten up your brighten up, brighten up your face and cover your imperfections too. So really a nice product. Next thing that I will do is I'm going to set up my um, under eye area. Next is eyebrows. So we're gonna fill, out, fill in our eyebrows. I'm going to use this Kathy Doll Sexy Brow Pencil. I like this eyebrow because it's, it really looks natural on me, so just lightly filling in my brows and the So I'm going to just dust off my powder on the under eye. I'm going to use the Cathy Doll What I Want. I miss you eye primer so if you want your eye shadow to last longer make sure to put primer all amount of product on my lids what I'm going to use as an eye shadow is an eyebrow product from Kathy Doll also the Kathy Doll triple eyebrow design this is really a multitasking, multitasking product because it's an eye, eyebrow pencil. Uh, I mean, eye, eyebrow powder, but you can use it also as your eyeshadow. So it's really, it's really good to have a multitasking product. It has three shades on it. First is I'm going to use the lightest shade. As a transition color on my lids so I'm going to put the darkest shade on the outer corner of my eyes and then blend it out for the middle shade of the product I'm just going to put it just going to put it at the inner area of my lids to make sure you put the darker, sh the darkest shade on your lower lash line. It's just 
put it half of your eye, half of the lash line. Add more a little dramatic on your eyes. Put a black eyeshadow, a little amount of black eyeshadow at the corner or the outer corner of the eyes. The next step that I will do is just going to put eyeliner. For my cheeks, it's a lip product, but I'm using it as a blusher, so I'm going to get some pigment, I uh, some um, product, and then put it on my cheek. Yeah, it's it's going to be hard because hard to blend because I already said it earlier I forgot but I'm just going to do my best using the lip blur the lip blur in electric paint next thing is I'm going to contour my face and I'm going to use the multitasking product the eyebrow the triple eyebrow designing Highlights, a little bit of highlight on our face, and for the final step, I'm going to put some lip products. So for today, I'm going to use the Kaki Dal Geisha Hana Zakari Lip Matte. Did they say right? Geisha Hana Zakari. Going to slightly remove. The outer outer part of the lips to look more gradient. I put on a little bit of cream and then just dab it and just add a little bit of product at the inner part. 